Hello dear friends, this is Hello Hollywood. That means you're in for some exciting news. Let's get started. Ben Affleck's decision to buy a new house doesn't seem to have affected Jennifer Lopez in any way. The 55-year-old music star continues to enjoy the summer despite her marriage to the Batman star slowly crumbling. The couple reunited in 2020 and tied the knot in 2022, but now 2024 could spell the end of their marriage and their second attempt at a relationship as the pair are reportedly experiencing a clash of characters and approaches to dealing with the media. Affleck moved out of their shared mansion in the Brentwood neighborhood of Los Angeles, while Lopez previously flew to the East Coast to celebrate her birthday without her husband who didn't even reunite for their anniversary. Now the Pearl Harbor actor has bought a new home in California's Pacific Palisades neighborhood where Matthew Perry used to live and spent 20 million dollars of his 150 million dollar fortune on it. But that doesn't seem to bother the on-the-floor singer who posed for the camera on Monday 29th July with a cute smile on her face in a white jumper with the sounds of Apple by Charlie XCX in the background. Lopez, who sported a ring on her finger that was neither wedding nor engagement ring, styled her brown hair and applied no makeup, throwing back the years and not at all looking like someone who is only 15 years into her 70s. Affleck's decision to buy a new home is the final nail in Benefer's coffin as their marriage, which was made before God in Las Vegas, continues to show that it has little chance of salvation as they lead separate lives. Lopez was reportedly horrified when she returned from Europe and saw that her husband had moved his personal belongings out of the house, but no one knows how he's really doing, not even his friends. Obviously he's going through something, or at least that's what the press is saying and stuff like that, Kevin Smith the director said at San Diego Comic Con. Me being his least trusted friend who is very secretive, my wife said, oh you've got to get in touch with him. And I said, the last person he wants to hear from right now is a guy who talks a lot. So when he's in a good state of mind, he'll let me know. So there you go dear friends, share this video and leave your comments. Bye.